Hi there, it's Peter here again, the guy who hates tomatoes but loves front-end development. Today I've got a super quick video. It's just an answer to Dave's question. So Dave is a new subscriber on my YouTube channel. And Dave, if you're watching, this is just the answer to your question, how to show the animation step in the DevTools. Okay, in my last video, I was showing some CSS animations and I thought the quickest way to show you how it works and where to find it is to create a video about it. Okay, so here I'm watching the video from last time, so I'll pause it. And if I scroll down, there's the question from Dave. Okay, so this is the question I'm replying to. And if I go to my blog, and if you logged in, if you are a user of my site, then clicking on my logo here in the top, la top right, will bring up some CSS animation. So I'm adding a class to a div and then triggering some animation. And if I wanna replay that in the browser, in the dev tools, I can simply right click, click on the inspect element. That will bring up the dev tools, but we will need to click on these three dots to reveal more options and click on the show console. That will bring another set of tools and the console, the, the animation tab is just next to the console. Okay, so the animation tab is empty by default. You need to refresh the page or replay the animation. And then it starts filling in with the animations that are happening on the page. And if I click on this, that's the animation triggering the my account and logout elements come in. And if I then drag the slider, I can replay the animation at my own speed. So the links are coming in. And then I can also change the playback to 25%, which means it's gonna play a little bit slower than the real life or real time. Or 10%. Okay, or you can just drag it back and forth to play the animation at your own speed. Okay, so hope that answers the question. As I said, super fast video, not a rocket science here, but don't be afraid to ask some beginner's question. I'm happy to answer them in my videos. And if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, or go to the best of page where you can subscribe and get the best of my content every week. Until next time, happy coding, bye.